I think water is so critical and important and it has such a nexus to enabling a community to thrive. And for us, we have a water scarcity here. We had a water challenge that our only source of water was going to be contaminated with seawater, which basically means you can't drink it. We rely on rainfall to refill our groundwater basin. And our community are rock stars at water conservation, but even that conservation hasn't proven to be enough. As water is extracted and there's not enough water to be replenished by rainfall, that's what created the kind of critical overdraft of the groundwater basin and caused seawater contamination and intrusion at the coastline. Developing a water supply project is a marathon. It's not a sprint. There's so many things that, that need to take place over a long period of time. Getting people to understand the problem and then understanding the technical aspects of it and the science and the data and then tying that to the community values, that's what narrowed us to recycled water. And I think that's why we've been able to go in about seven years from kind of planning a project to actually constructing the project. I think that people are learning about the critical foundational role that water plays in communities. When you, when you go through a city, you don't see the water infrastructure. You don't see the pipelines, you don't see the treatment plants, you don't see all of the intricacies of what it takes to be able to deliver water to the tap and to take wastewater away. And so we have spent a tremendous amount of time educating, showcasing the role that recycled water can play and should play and must play within our communities to be able to have a secure water future. The sanctuary is uh, one of the largest marine protected areas in the nation. It was designated by Congress for the purposes of resource protection, research, and education. Water is a really big part of people's lives here. It brings people to the area to appreciate the ocean and the beauty that we have here, but it also provides a lot of recreational activities as well, whether it's surfing. We're internationally renowned for our diving and all of the organisms that you see when you go out into the ocean. We're lucky here in California, especially on the Central Coast, that there is a, an ethic of environmental protection. Many people ask, what does advanced purification mean? And it's important to think that we're beginning with the source water that's already been treated. Now we're going to take that water and we're gonna provide six additional treatment steps to it to get it to drinking water standards. As a community, as a globe, we tend to be really quick to label the drop by its history. Oh, that's wastewater. Oh, it's stormwater. Is it potable water? Is it groundwater? And my perspective is we need to look at this holistically and make sure that we're making the best decisions for every drop of water in our community. And with that challenge, we now have to look at how do we manage water differently. When we think about that secure water future, it is also understanding the impacts of climate change and what is happening around the globe. And recycled water plays a great role because it allows us to now decouple climate from water supply. And so we really saw this as an asset that we could take that water, which has already been treated, and then further treat it through advanced water purification and then put that back into the groundwater basin. So it was able to replenish the basin, it was able to create this freshwater seawater barrier and create that front line of defense to protect our groundwater supply. And it's the collaboration across the community because no one alone can solve the challenge by themselves, but together communities can provide a sustainable water infrastructure. It's an asset that we need to protect, that we need to replenish, and this project isn't just about supporting a community, it's about environmental stewardship. To be able to create sustainability, resiliency, and reliability for my children, for my friends, for my community, I want to help create that sustainability.